Bluff Gaming here with a super quick Atlas tutorial showing how to get water when you're out on a deserted island. Of course, if you find water in a pool somewhere, it may be fresh water that you can drink, but that's not always guaranteed. In fact, it's quite rare. So find some green ground like this, press X to get down on the ground, and then just look down and click. You can't dig for water here, you need greener ground. I found greener ground and you saw there was a little bar on the bottom that had a target floating by. You have to aim that target and click right as it goes through the white bar. So let's try that again. Right there, click, we're good. It may give you multiples, just keep doing the mini game and eventually you'll get a spout of water that you can drink out of. That's your bottom line up front. See you on the high seas. Thanks for sticking around. Now that we know how to get a basic spout out of the ground, let's look at some other ways that we might be able to get water. Um, of course, you can always have a chance at finding a pool of water somewhere. And on this island, we happen to have a pool of water that is fresh that we can use. One nice thing about pools of fresh water is that you can fill your containers with them very easily. And I'll run right over to this one and we can take a look. As you can see in my toolbar, I have two water skins. One has water in it, the other doesn't, and you can tell how one of them is highlighted. That's the one with water in it. There's also a bar at the bottom of it showing you how much water is left. If I open my inventory, I can hover down here and see that I have 96 out of 100 water in the water skin. I haven't actually consumed any. These just have a very slow leak, so that's something you need to keep in mind if you're about to take a long trip. This other one is still uh, essentially empty with one out of 100, but we can go fill it in this pool of water just by running down into the water itself, looking down and pressing the appropriate hotkey. Now, if we take a look, we see this one's at 96 and that one's at 100. Again, to drink it, all you have to do is hit the hotkey of the container you wanna drink from and you're good to go. And another thing worth mentioning is that Earlier, whenever I dug the hole using my hands, you want to look for some green ground. Don't go for the sand like this. Look for green ground. That's the best place to do it. And if you have a shovel, you'll get even more water than if you dug with your hands. However, digging with your hands can get you all the water you need. Uh, if you're very thirsty, just do it a few times and you should be good. Of course, if it rains, that's another opportunity for you to get water, but not too necessary because it is pretty easy to get water so long as you can find some grassy area. I hope this quick tutorial was useful for you. Like, comment, or subscribe if you enjoyed this and you thought you might like more of my tutorials. Of course, if you didn't, you can unsubscribe, but if you do that, I'm going to do a rain dance in reverse next time I sail past your island. Good luck then, buddy. All right, catch you on the next tutorial. See you on the high seas.